I got a word that describes last episode in my head. What happened again last episode? <laughs> Shigaraki is hunting down our main character, Gon. That's a broken real estate, man. Destroyed. The repair after this is gonna be so extensive. <laughs> They're gonna have to start over completely. Jeez, look at that. So it's like a meteor struck. Imagine how All Might's gonna feel. Oh, uh, the air, he just sitting oh. there. Literally a child watching a large scale terrorist attack. I feel so bad for All Might. I know. He can't do much. I really hope we don't lose anybody is like that. Deku's Deku's mom? If yeah, she were so. to die or something unexpectedly, wouldn't that be crazy? Okay. There's his mom. I'm in the mental <laughs> asylum. There's his mom. He's smiling. He's connected to it. Is that how he knows? Ugh. As long as uh, we don't have eyes well blinking, maybe we're all right. But, but no way, the no moves are gonna show up. Right? They already have. They're coming through the ground. Spoke too this. soon, my man. Like the demon one, <laughs> demon dog. The pack resonates with me. <laughs> Bakugo's face. You know, an interesting point that somebody brought up in the comments section before, maybe it's not necessarily that the Nomus didn't decay because like the capsules were so good that they were yeah. built in, but that might be a testament to just how well Shigaraki can control the power. So maybe not everything decay that he well, touches if he doesn't want it to. he doesn't want it to. Sheesh. He's blasting away. Swatting like a fly. Oh. <laughs> like a shooting star. Oh my gosh. The way he just stood on top of him so disrespectfully. Look how ripped he is. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. You just see the gnomes in the back picking up heroes. What if that's a little foreshadowing? Like independent thought. Just kill this guy. We gotta get info out of him, True. but like, they're still being tested. The prototypes. He said they can't think on their own. Feels like some easy foreshadowing for independent thought being developed, though. Near high end. God, the music. Dum Disaster Walker. What a title. He jumped like it was nothing, like it was a pebble. His eyes. Oh. Of course he's gonna go for him. Oh, gosh. You can see my kids graduate. <laughs> yes! Good voice acting. Yeah, I felt that. <gasps> Let's go! Oh wow! <laughs> Big ol' headbutt. <laughs> Gotta have all hands on deck, man. Heck yeah, let's go. See, so we finally have him face to face, quite literally. Mm -hmm. So long ago. I know. I love them stepping in. Together, too. Mm -hmm. So in sync. Do you see him with those whips? It's not gonna be enough. <gasps> I love that. <laughs> oh, they're putting out their best effort right now. He can barely walk. Uh -uh. Right, even without his quirks right now, he's that strong. You have no choice but to fight now. You won't be able to. Get out of my head, Dad! Ugh. It's like he's speaking through him. He literally is. He literally just spoke through him. He said little brother. He's yeah. talking to his actual brother. Yeah. He notices. Resonates in him. Like the highest peak of himself is in him. His Thanks, father. Daddy. <laughs> Not get defeated like you did. Right, bye. He's even decaying him off! Wait, he is. He's like, I want to do this my own. Oh, El Nosabe. Look at his eye real quick. One stay up and the other calm down. You do that with your eye? Bro? Uh <laughs> I love that he's still wearing that cape. It's all tattered up. Direct line of sight. 
Oh, he looks so scary. Uh, he doesn't like being ignored. Dude, that is explosive. Yeah. Massive development moment for him. <laughs> Yo! Let's go. He didn't even take a barely a hit. So many nuances of personalities here. Oh, they're going for it. If he's unscathed by this. That's a number one hero moment right there. Man, things are going crazy back at the studio, huh? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna see Toga and all of them now trying to escape. Something oh, giant. They're doomed. That's just such a big problem for their side of things. He's just gonna kill that guy or not? I think he's gonna take them and oh. leave. Cause Shigi would want them to be with him. <laughs> and Toga's also there. Naked and all. Little naked. Put <laughs> your clothes on, girl. He gave her some clothes. Stop it, man. Yeah, he can sense them. The fact that he just came out of the ground. <gasps> What's he got in mind there? They want to use him for something. Dude, we're, we're gonna have Makia and Mal Lady. I'm already calling it. They're gonna like wrestle. Yeah, face to face. Who do you think's gonna win? I think Makia is just too strong. I'm too big. I mean, to be entrusted as like a bodyguard to all for one. Look how strong he is too. Woo! She's holding her own. WWE looking crazy this season. Let's go, girl. They gotta get out of there. And it's like, what are we gonna do? I think Minata is gonna save the day. <laughs> She's even saying he's way too strong. Ah, uh, they're gonna come out and finish her off. She There's... can't even push him off. He's oh. just moving. This is Cementus. That's really helpful quirk to have. <gasps> There's Redestro. Dude, wow. that imagery though. That was cool. It's metamorphosis is complete. We kind of forget how strong Reed Destro is. It was a crazy fight with him and, and Shiggy. She can't even stop him for a second. He's too focused. <laughs> yeah. can't. She can't even make a dent into this. And he's like smelling it out. <gasps> Like a rag doll. Oh, if they meet up together in the city, it is game over. What is she gonna do? We can knock him out though. She can put him to sleep. You gotta knock him out. It's the only way. Yeah, I guess we gotta back up. Dang it! No. <sighs> so close. That's a tough fall. Is they, this defeat? They couldn't do a thing though. Like, they all tried. He's way too powerful. They're definitely not gonna hide. They're gonna go to the front front of the battlefield. Mm -hmm. I think she still has a chance. Use anesthetics to put him to sleep. That's her ability, right? Make anesthetics to get to the heroes and get out of there. So she's gonna get Momo to make anesthetic. Oh, Dude, no shot we lose midnight. If we make enough anesthetic, we can put him to sleep, but... It's like a leadership moment thing. The callback to earlier seasons. She's come a long way. <laughs> Bro. Look at him. Stop. Mouth open. Roll. Don't freak out, man. Yes! Okay. She's leading the, the pack, Good directing the army. That music it just gave me chills down my arms. I know, it's so good. That's slowing down. Oh, nice! <laughs> That's her grabbing him. I haven't clung to a guy since uh -huh. middle school, bro. Whoa, she's making her little item. I think a lot of people forget this has just been a year's time. Are those the anesthetics? Yes. Everybody's growing up, man. One year deep in as well. Yes.
They give uh, the supporting characters so much build up through the seasons, you can really see it now. Like, all back to when Todoroki and Momo had to do that thing against Aizawa in the training task. Mm -hmm. And she just, like, had the biggest panic, but, like, figured it out in the end. And yeah. also, another training test later on where they had to... It was the Hero's Provisional License, I think. All roads lead to season six. Like, all the personality traits of Bakugo and Deku's relationship. I particularly liked how uh, they, they ended us out here with that big build up. And we have a lot going on. So, next week's where we find out what happened. I really am enjoying how the season's going so far. It's by far already my favorite season of, of My Hero Academia. Oh, definitely. And we haven't even gotten to the climactic things. That's hard to believe because it's been so good. Thanks for watching over YouTube. Check out the Patreon watch completely uncut and early and make sure you subscribe for more content like this. We'll see you guys in the next week's episode of My Hero Academia.